Okay, everybody, we're going to be playing some Hotline Miami. This is uh, one of my favorite game series, as noted by the fact that I use Jacket for pretty much all my avatars. I'm going to tell you how to kill people. This game is controlled with the left and right stick. So, yes, I am using a controller, which is uh, a first. I've never played this game with a controller before. Right, RB to punch. Do this, press the A button, RB to punch, A button to finish. Alright. Okay. I'm more concerned about movement, because this is a mouse and keyboard game. Um, it has tank controls. It's a, it's kind of an interesting game. It's very similar to the first Metal Gear game on NES, with the, the way it's it runs. Okay. Alright, so, boom. LB picks up weapons, alright. So you can also throw weapons. So I could take this and I could just throw it at him like this. Knock him out. And then finish him. Let's get the guns. Okay. R and R trigger. Lock on. Alright. And who do we have here? Oh, you don't know who you are? Maybe we should leave it that way. But I know you. Look at my face. We've met before, haven't we? I don't know you! Why are you here? You're no guest of mine. Do you really want me to reveal who you are? Knowing oneself means acknowledging one's actions, as of lately. You've done some terrible things. You don't remember me? I'll give you a clue. Does April the 3rd mean anything to you? I believe that was the day of our first encounter. You look like you might be remembering something. Alright, April 3rd, 1989. Let's begin. This Jacket. This is Jacket's apartment. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna answer the phone here and get into a crazy situation. You have one new message. Hi, this is Tim at the bakery. The cookies that you ordered should be delivered by now. A list of ingredients are included. Make sure that you read them carefully. Click. All right. So we're gonna go pick up some cookies. But first, let's get Richard. The target is a briefcase. Discretion is of essence. Leave target at point F32 inside the dumpster. Failure is not option. We'll be watching you. Alrighty. And into the car we go to go pick up some cookies. The Metro Station. By the way, soundtrack of this game, absolutely awesome. Okay. Um, so I have a lot of masks already unlocked because I've already beaten this game. So... Let's see here. I think I'm going to be Don Juan. This is honestly, in my opinion, the most useful master is. Look at the scope of the place here. Um, so you got a guy in the bathroom peeing. Oh, oh, we're not getting cookies, by the way. We're killing all these men. Um, the goal is to kill everyone on the floor that you're currently on. And then leave dead. That's the perk of this mask. You open a door, it will kill whoever's on the other side. Pretty handy. Very handy. Yeah, I killed this guy who's taking a leak. Just gotta remember my controls here. Alright. See ya. Alright. Done. Easy. Next floor. Alright, I got a knife with a knife here. Got a guy patrolling this area. Uh, we got two guys here, and this is the guy with the briefcase, and I'm pretty sure if I remember he doesn't even attack. So let's take this guy out. He's dead. Oh, he's dead. So if you get in someone's sight, they will bum rush you. Um, if they have a gun, they will shoot you on sight. And something you will notice here very soon, probably, is that uh, it's one shot and you're dead. You get, you don't have a health bar. It's it's 
one hit and you're dead. Doesn't matter what kind of weapon they have. The difference with weapons is that some of them, like this knife, has a faster swing. As opposed to the bat, which is slower. Some weapons have better reach. And then guns, of course, have a different rate of fire, so. So he's gone, and he's gone. Alright. And we got these guys here, and I'm just gonna kinda lure them toward me. Alright, and they're gone. Alright, and then this guy. See ya. And then we got the briefcase. And we're going to leave. The train's coming now. Oh my, what could that mean? Two more guys. Now, the briefcase is the only weapon in the game, as far as I know, I could be wrong, that is not a one-shot kill. You gotta knock them down and then bash your head in. Easy enough, though. Off we go. And here's the target location, the dumpster, where we're putting the briefcase. Oh, and there's our old friend, the hobo. Who's there? I can hear you. I know you're there. Uh, we gotta kill this man, unfortunately. Which is not a hard task. Oh, Jack is supposed to vomit there, but for some reason he did. So, okay. Whatever. Yay! And a nice B minus. I am not an expert at this game, so uh, I don't expect to ever get an A. What's up, man? Eating those donuts? All right, let's go talk to Mally and Mac. Hi there, man. I haven't seen you around. Thought something might have happened to you. You seemed really down over losing your girlfriend. Don't remember seeing you after that. Maybe we should talk about something else. So, out for a midnight snack, huh? Oh, don't worry about it. It's on the house. Good to see you. Have a nice night. Got a nice, uh, nice fresca here. And, uh, back to our house. And that's the end of our first, uh, delivery, I guess you could say. But wait, there's more. You have one new message. Hello, it's Linda. I need a babysitter. Right away! Got a few kids that need to be disciplined here. I'm at East 7th Street. Make sure you have a long talk with them. I really need someone to get through to these rascals. And like last time, please be discreet. Okay, well we got our cookie, so now we're gonna go spank some children, I guess. Uh, something tells me they're gonna be a bunch of bald rooskies that are not children. I kind of want to switch things around. Maybe I'll be uh, Tony. Tony is you can kill people with your fists. One shot. So no enemies on this floor, so we're just going to go in and walk up. Alright, let's see here. So this guy's all by himself, pretty much. You gotta be careful, because some of the times these guys will walk out of the rooms that they're patrolling. And surprise you. So we got a bathroom here that has nothing. Is there a guy in here? There is. This is why Don Juan would come in handy, because I could kill that guy. And then I don't have to worry about him rushing me. So I think I'm going to skip him for now. Guy in that room. I'm going to go right... This guy's by himself, so I'm going to go ahead and take him out. Oops. There's really no reason to even have a weapon, unless it's a gun. I can't remember if... Yeah, that guy does have someone in there. Okay. Fuck! <sighs> Alright. First death. That's okay. It's gonna happen a lot. Because I am not very good at this game. Alright. See ya. Get the machete. Machete's good.
The guy's in the bathroom now, so I might be able to... Whoops. That's kind of cool. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, I thought that would kill him. It's a machete. Oh, shit. Alright, done. Alright, let's get out of this hellhole. Yeah, let's go visit Mally and Mac again. But first, our score. Which is probably not very good. A B! Somehow I did better than the last one. Okay, we're at the pizzeria. Hi there, welcome. Oh, you don't need to order. Your pizza's already done. I had a feeling you were on your way here. Well, let's just leave it at that for now, shall we? Don't worry about paying. It's on the house. Free pizza. Free fresca. We're good to go. And we're off to our next adventure. On April 16, 1989, in Miami, Florida, today, Jack had picked up the phone, and then... We have one new message. This is Thomas from the Methadone Clinic. We've scheduled a short meeting for you tonight. We're at Northwest 184th Street, apartment 105. Now don't worry, we know discretion is of importance to our clients. Click. Okay, well I guess it's time to go to rehab. Overdose. Don't be afraid of dying, good tip. Okay, um... Who do we want to be now? Let's be Jones! Let's have some nasty kills. Alright, let's see what we got here. So, we got a guy here smoking, got a guy by himself, but notice that he has two windows here. So that is a gameplay mechanic, but they can see through the windows. And if he has a gun, he will shoot through those. Got a guy patrolling here. Got a guy taking a leak. Except these windows. I don't care about these. And I got a guy smoking over here. If I remember right, this is a little bit of a tricky uh, level. This is where it starts getting a little bit more complex. So... The problem with this level is this guy up here. You can't really see him. So you have to be really quick about taking out this guy and this guy without this guy seeing any of it. So here we go. Alright. Whoops. Okay. Somehow that did not alert a single person. So that's interesting. Probably keep the shotgun. Never know. Right. Probably don't need it with this guy. Oop. Well, I did not mean to do that. I have left is that room. Oh, this guy's gotta come in here. Nope. Oh boy. Alright, we gotta find a. Not a shotgun. This might work. It's a silence pistol, I believe. Some 
somehow that guy did not see a thing. Interesting. Alright. And that's the end of that. Let's get the hell out of here. What is our score this time? I would say a B minus or a C plus. B, even better. All right, now we're at the video store. Hey dude, good to see you again. Did you hear about the massacre the other night? A bunch of Ruskies I heard. No loss fear, if you ask me. They say some maniac wearing a rubber mask did it. Sounds like a scene straight from a slasher flick. Oh yeah, I had the perfect film for you. The one on the desk, take it. It's on the house. Enjoy yourself, dude. Okay, cool. Got a fresca, a pizza, and now a movie. And away we go. To our fourth adventure. April 25th, 1989 in Miami, Florida. Jacket wakes up and gets a phone call from... Hi, it's Kate from Hotline Miami's dating service. We have set up a date for you this evening. She'll be waiting for you at Southwest 53rd place. As usual, make sure you wear something fancy. Click. Well, I'm already wearing something fancy. I look like Ryan Gosling and Drive. That's pretty fancy. Okay, third chapter. Decadence. I love this song. Alright, I think we're gonna be Louie. Louie Beans! Okay. This one's a little tricky with the um, layout. So we gotta go pretty much make a circle around here take all these guys out because this guy will see you if you try to go down the hallway so we're gonna knock him down and then boom done all right and then this room we are going to wait for him to turn his back oh 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 oh, oh. Yeah, guns are... Guns are risky. Machete, I like that. Oh, no, no, oh, no! I died. Yeah, he's gonna walk by the door at some point. Maybe. Come on, man. Okay, his AI is trapped. I just got fucked there. Yeah. Alright. Oh god. I saw someone. Maybe not. Alright. Alright, this should be actually fairly simple. There. Alright. Oh my god, this dude. The boss. So we're not going to fight him yet, but we are going to rescue our girlfriend, the hooker. There she is. He's in there eating some cheese puffs. Um, I think I'll take this. I can't remember what the layout of this room's like. Oh god. I kind of regret taking a gun. Oh, I got this. Alright, cool. 
Oh, shit. Alright. <laughs> okay. Ugh. didn't alert a single person. shotgun because the boss is going to be awoken now and this guy's a heavy and he can only die by shotgun nothing else works on him pretty easy though oh god please don't oh oh yes do a scene at game of thrones there and uh yeah just get it over with i knew this would end like this and we're going to take our girlfriend home. And that is Chapter 1 of Hotline Miami. Not too bad. I've only died a handful of times, surprisingly. A B minus to tap it off, and uh, let's go to the bar for a drink. Hi there, welcome. You don't look well, sir. Are you all right? Are you sure it is okay for you to be drinking? All right, then I'll get you something special. Do you like sweet or sour? Maybe you want it bitter. And there you go, sir. Enjoy. Wasn't on the house. 